Greetings, Royal Enthusiasts. It's wonderful to have you back for your go-to update on Royal Happenings and Insights. First off, I'd like to extend my heartfelt gratitude for the overwhelming support and affection you've shown. If you haven't yet joined our subscriber community, what's stopping you? Click that subscribe button right away. Don't forget to activate the notification bell, too. Moreover, if our content resonates with you and you'd like to delve deeper into our community, we invite you to support us on Patreon. It's the hub for exclusive content, sneak peeks, and a chance to engage with us more intimately. Find the link in our video description. Now, on to today's discussion. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are back in the spotlight, facing criticism from royal commentator Angela Levin. Despite their public stance against cyberbullying, Levin has called them out as hypocrites, alleging that they bullied Queen Elizabeth for financial gain in her final months. The irony isn't lost here. The couple, vocal about the ills of cyberbullying, now stand accused by Levin of exhibiting the same behaviors they decry. In a candid interview with GB News, Levin shared her dismay, emphasizing the couple's proclaimed dedication to combating bullying and cyberbullying, juxtaposed with their actions towards the Queen. Levin's charges escalated significantly when she highlighted the supposed harassment aimed at Queen Elizabeth during her frail final months. It might have been improper to harass Queen Elizabeth, especially when she was severely ill and in the twilight of her life. She noted, as the royal commentator continued, that several individuals have shared similar views, asserting that numerous people accused them of harassing her for financial motives, among other reasons. These claims starkly contrast the image Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have meticulously crafted prompting doubts about the genuineness of their dedication to combating harassment. Levin boldly underscored what she views as the couple's duplicity, commenting, it's their duplicity that casts doubt on their credibility. The alleged financial exploitation of Queen Elizabeth juxtaposed with their public anti-harassment stance introduces further intrigue into the narrative surrounding the duo. As this scandal unfolds, the world anticipates Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's rebuttal to these grave charges. Should these allegations be substantiated, it could severely damage the couple's trustworthiness and how the public perceives them, leading many to question the legitimacy of their anti-harassment advocacy. So, what are your thoughts on this matter? Do Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's efforts against cyber harassment seem hypocritical in light of the accusations that they harassed Queen Elizabeth for monetary benefits, as royal analyst Angela Levin suggests? Share your opinions in the comments and let me know your thoughts. In the meantime, we'll have to wait and see what unfolds. And, if you don't want to miss out on any of my hot royal updates, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon. It's that easy. So, until next time, hasta la